Hi, this is Matt with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we'll be showing you how to repair your appliance. Remember, anytime you work on an appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there's no chance of electrocution. Also make sure you turn off the dishwasher's water supply underneath the sink. In this video, we're going to show you how to change out the Maytag dishwasher docking station. It's going to be a very easy repair and should only take a few minutes to show you how to do it. If you already have one of these, great. If not, you can click on the link below or get it at AppliancePartsPros.com. When you open up the package, you're going to get the new docking station. The docking station is where the spray arm on the upper dish rack gets its water from. The main reason you'd be changing it out is if the seals are damaged and water is spraying all over the place. In order to get to the docking station, we're going to have to open up the dishwasher door and remove the upper rack. To get the upper rack off, we have to pull it out a little bit so we can grab these end caps and get them off. All you have to do is press on this little release right here and then you can pull the end cap off. The one on the other side comes off the same way. With the end caps off, we can pull the upper rack off and set it aside. To get the docking station out, we're going to take a small flathead screwdriver and pop one side off to release the locking tab so we can pull it out. Here's the old docking station next to the new one. If you already have one of these, great. If not, you can get it at AppliancePartsPros.com. Sometimes when you get these, the little flapper valves have fallen out. So you have to take and make sure that you set these on the white pins and press them all the way down. Once you have them both in place, we can put in the dishwasher. To put the docking station in, all you have to do is hook one side of the tabs on and then rotate it over so it locks in place. Now that we have the docking station installed, we can put the upper dish rack back in. All you have to do is line up the wheels with the rails and push them back into place. Once you have it all the way in, we can put the end caps back. All you have to do is line it up the same way you took it off press in the release tab and push it in so it locks in place. Once you have it all the way in, we can close the dishwasher door. Now that you're done repairing the appliance, you can plug it back in, turn the water back on, and take it for a spin. Thanks for joining us for another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. Check out our other repair videos on our site, Facebook, and YouTube.